আসসালামু আলাইকুম সবাইকে স্বাগত জানাচ্ছি সিয়েরা লিওনের মাকিনি শহরে আর্নেস বাই করমা ইউনিভার্সিটি অফ সায়েন্স অ্যান্ড টেকনোলজি এটা এখানকার বড় একটা পাবলিক বিশ্ববিদ্যালয় এটা নিয়ে এর আগে একটা ভিডিও দিয়েছি তো আমি যে দিন এই ইউনিভার্সিটিতে আসলাম সেদিন বন্ধের দিন ছিল কিন্তু মেল হলে কিছু শিক্ষার্থীর সাথে দেখা হলো তো তাদের সাথে সিয়েরা লিওনের বিভিন্ন বিষয় নিয়ে কথা হলো বাংলা ভাষা বিশ্ববিদ্যালয়ের পড়াশোনা তাদের রাজনীতি অনেক বিষয় নিয়ে কথা হলো পাশাপাশি তারাও আমাকে অনেক প্রশ্ন করছে তো আজকে আমি এখানকার বিশ্ববিদ্যালয়ের শিক্ষার্থীদের সাক্ষাৎকারটা আপনাদেরকে দেখাবো ধৈর্য ধরে শেষ পর্যন্ত দেখবেন তো এটা হলো এখানে মেল হোস্টেল এই হোস্টেলের সামনেই বিশ্ববিদ্যালয় কিছু ছাত্র আড্ডা দিচ্ছিল তাদের সাথে আমি অনেকক্ষণ কথা বলেছি ওকে থ্যাংক ইউ Bangladesh and uh, basically I am a clinical psychologist. I studied in my country, Dhaka University. This is the biggest public university in my country. Okay. Uh, so I, I am in your country from this uh, January. I am working in Makini Regional Hospital. Okay. So just came to see your university. And, uh, <laughs> so, but uh, by the way, do you hear the name of Bangladesh? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. What do you know about Bangladesh? Well, we... And uh, if, uh, if, uh, my mind could serve me well, during the revolution, or immediately after the revolution, the 11 years yeah. civil war, mm -hmm. I think there were people from this country, mm -hmm. there yeah, were philanthropists yeah. or peacekeepers, mm -hmm. they were donors. Immediately when we came from the 11 years civil war, বাংলাদেশ <laughs> I, I think Bangladesh is, I don't know, one of the developing countries are in Middle East. I think there you read. It's the Asian country, Asia. South Asia. South Asia. Middle East, Asia. Yeah. South Asia. Yeah. I think it's one of the developing countries there. Yeah, you are right. It's the developing country now, yeah. yeah. Anything But as well, you? the country plays its role. Yeah. It does play more so when there are crises in other countries around the world. The country does go and... Yeah, we have, uh, you know, our military is really nice. They are good friends. Okay. That's why during any crisis, anywhere, especially I mean African countries, oh, yeah, the United uh, Nations, they send them to to establish the peace. So, uh, but I'm here, you know, when I came to your country, when the people uh, hear that I'm from Bangladesh, so they just notice, uh, no, told me that during uh, war, the Bangladeshi peace sure, was exactly. Yeah. They were in several <laughs> Just one thing, you know, in my country, the people, many people know that, uh, I think it's, it's, when I came here, I, I, I came to know that it's not right, that Bangla, you know, we, our main language is Bangla, our mother tongue is Bangla, even our national language is Bangla, okay. but some YouTubers, they published some video, they said that Bangla is the second official language in your country, do you know anything about it? Bangladesh. <laughs> yeah, Bangla. The language itself. The language itself. Would be an official language in your second, country. Second, second. Second, you know? second official language in your country. Several years. Yes. Hello? Hello? Um, wow. No, no, no. You no, no, no. don't know anything. You ah. don't know anything about it. Huh? Hello? <laughs> yeah, even when I came here, I used to know, know that it, like in my country, the media, the some YouTuber, they, they exaggerated. They exaggerated. They say, uh, uh, Bangla is yeah, Bangla is the second language in your country. Yeah. <laughs> maybe maybe fallacious just an influence, maybe people. you come and see. It's fallacious. No, you know, my, my office sent me here to do my job. Five, eight, I'm not, eight, I, I didn't come here just <laughs> to know it, because, you know, I'm doing eight, a uh, seven, job in humanitarian work. Uh, okay, in regard to that, uh, have you ever yeah. met with no. somebody that could speak Bangla here in Sierra Leone? No. Mm. So yeah. that no, was to some, show you some that. People, yeah, yeah, some yeah. people, like uh, during OR, you are a kid. So some people who work with the peacekeeper, that time, you know now the, even my, my colleague, oh, yes. they know few words of yes. Bangladesh. Yes. Yes. I know few words of your country. Yes. Like Nama Nama Akbar. Why? 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 No, Why? some, they try, you understand? Yeah. Because they've been close to those people. Yeah, that broke, yeah, that, that broke, yes, exactly. 
Like like I know some of you are, you know, uh-huh. name uh, howdy body, name ni makbor, akbor bangladesh. <laughs> that doesn't mean I know your language. Yeah. So yeah, then yeah, my yeah, colleague yeah. told me, I, I like teach them some language. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Most small Most about their language. Yeah. Thinking of a language occupying a second position in a country, it's not, it's not, it's it doesn't not, mean not, only uh, a minute number of people who speak it. Ah. It's supposed to spread wild mm. and... Even if, it is, if, even if it is declaration that honorary declaration, at least you people supposed to know because you are a university. Exactly. Yeah. That means that you are totally right. Totally right. Sometimes the students are in India. Uh, maybe supposed to do it. Bangladesh. Yeah. 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 Bangladesh. Bangladesh. We never knew any language like Bangla being a second language in Sierra Leone. For us here, Creole is what we accept to be our national language. When you, t- you c- when you come to official language, then things become more English. Mm-hmm. English yeah. Creole yeah. is wild. wild. It's yeah. wild. Why, it goes it beyond come? borders uh, here yeah. in Sierra Leone. Uh, uh, yeah. So yeah. it's yeah. Yeah. almost n- yeah. 90%. Yeah. Though, though we are going to fact that. Anyway, which subject you are studying? Like, you are study here, yeah? You're all which, subject? Yeah. 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 which subject you are studying? I'm a language student. English language. English. And my native language. Ah. Good accounting. Accounting. So accounting English. Oh, bachelor's in business administration. Minimal resource management. Okay. And you? Economics. Ah, good subject. And you? You joined it as accounting. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it's like public university. You need to pay for the. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 We, we, we pay. We pay. We pay. We pay. We pay. Okay. We, we pay. And what is the process of getting admission here? You have to give uh, admission test. Well, like uh, in the first place, you need to have the qualification requirement from the yeah. SS, from the secondary school. Okay. You need to have the which is, uh, not five credits include English, language, so English. So you have to have a special qualification in English yeah. to get admission. Five exactly. credits include English language. Okay. So after that, you secure the form by paying four hundred euros, new euros. All years, for for us here. years, for four hundred. Yeah, for the undergraduate programs. For, uh, programs. If it's 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 and uh, yeah. how many years of your course? Is it four years? For, for years. undergraduates, yeah. uh, yeah. like for degrees, four years. Four years. Yeah. For yeah. diplomas yeah. and other certificates, yeah. I think two years. Yeah. And three. Two years. Like yeah. in my country also, I think that in my country, the primary school is from class one to class five, then secondary school yeah. class yeah. six to class ten, then the college eleven, twelve, then the university. Like for graduation, four years. After graduation, masters, it's uh, one year. Okay, for all year. Yeah. Okay, another question. I hope you are not <laughs> you are not getting me wrong for lots of my question. Yeah. Uh-huh. A- another question is like I'm not in my country. I can share my country situation. Like the Dhaka University, the uh, public university, biggest one, and uh, we have um, uh, you know politics in the university. <laughs> politics mm-hmm. and you know the ruling Pizza? party, the opposition party. Yeah, right. all <laughs> the, what about in your country? Uh, well, I think that is a is a swell working here. This is a oh, yeah, exactly it's a swell, swell working in, in several years here. Yeah. Almost all the public universities yeah. are based on political. But are you like clash each other or that is no, uh, it's, it, it's no. good. No, that is quite managed here. Yeah. It's quite so managed good here. Yeah. Ruling party and opposition yeah. here. Yes, yeah. Yeah. of course, each and every student belongs to a, politi- a political party, but that is not displayed here in the university. That's the university you, yeah, we, you are okay. Yeah, yeah we are quite okay here. Yeah. What about other universities? They do clash? Well, like that's hardly happens. It's hardly, hardly based on political basis, except other minute associations you know i think uh, even in our country it might be there okay. you know we have factions of associations this might say i'm mr black this might say i'm mr, mr. red you know just but within based the, on, okay in order we will call them fraternity or so but that is not something that we can back students clubs you and must associate find yourself in a university you must belong yeah. somewhere but it is not compulsory it's based on your evolution if you like you join it, you don't want nobody harasses you. Indian politics. Yeah. No, yeah, to yeah, stay in those days. No, was in the of them. Do you need like support someone or no? Buy? No. So here, yeah, yeah, you will be no, charged no. that you yeah, pay. pay when one pay. It's free. Then free for every, for you. every student. So for one year, how much you have to pay? 
Well, like uh, for for us, we are um, we are paying eight hundred dollars. Per year. Yeah. New new year. New year. So, yeah. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much. Do you have any question for me? I asked you lots of question. If you are, if you have any question well, about my country, you well, can ask me. Well, my yeah. my first question here is um, what motivated you to be here today? No, okay. I am here, I am in your country since the last January and I am living in New York, very close to you. Many times I am passing this road and always thinking to visit the university. So he is my colleague, I, he is working in my team. So today in the morning I went to hospital to support the patients. Then I asked him, I want to visit the university. I want to see it. That is the only motive. So when I have seen you, I asked him, do the university uh, student? Then I was thinking, let's talk with them. I would love to talk with you. That is the. So there is no pre-planned motive to come here to ask <laughs> this question. It's just immediate All pop right. up in my mind. All right. You are you are almost coming to right yeah, when you came to Saudi Arabia. Yes. Yeah. So what are some of the differences that you've seen, or what are some of the things that you've learned to about Saudi Arabia? Okay, honestly stated, I think Sierra Leone is the fourth country I visited from Africa. I, I, I was uh, two times in Ethiopia, I visited uh, Kenya, I visited, I worked one year in uh, Nigeria. Ah, ah, ah. He's okay, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. first thing, I have to say that the people of Sierra Leone, they are really friendly. Okay. Really, honestly stated, they are really friendly and they are really like acceptable. I don't know many people, like you know, I just came to here to ask you, and uh, you become my friends. <laughs> so this is one thing from my side, like Sierra Leone people everywhere, everywhere. You know, I'm playing the bo football, volleyball with them. I'm visiting the village after village. So the people, it's like they are ready to welcome me. And when they hear that I'm from Bangladesh, and like you, they have some memory with the Bangladeshi military. Yeah, well, so they just gone. accept me. Another thing, I think Sierra Leone is the safest country for us. For us experts who uh, we are doing job here, sure. in many other countries, we are not allowed to even go out from our room. Like sure. so, hospital to house, <laughs> hospital to house. But here it's totally safe. I can go uh, alone anywhere. Even at night, at day, with the jungle, with the bush. <laughs> like I am here for, I think, uh, I, I came out from my room at, at 8. If it is other country, by 30 minutes they would call me. Akbar, where are you? Come back. <laughs> but until now, nobody. I think it's 3 hours. Nobody just even asking, where are you? Because even organization knows everything. is. So I think this is the biggest thing for us, that it's very safe for us. So why is safe? The people are safe. People consider us as a friendly. Okay. So now you are going back to your country. Yes. So what could be your take home message in a situation a brother of yours may want to come over to Sierra Leone to establish any development? development. What could be your take home no. message? I think, you know, like, I love the education system in your country. Okay. Basically, the language, every student, even from class one, they, they speak in English. It's really, and I, 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 am, I have to say it, it's, it's on video. I will share with you as well. I hope within 10 to 15 years, Sierra Leone would be the biggest educated country in at least African, African by God, continent. By God. Wow. I, I'm sure. I can, uh, because the, the system of your education, and I found some other African country, the way p children here to love to go to school and their passion to learn, that is really nice. So I think Sierra Leone is going to be a good country within 15 to 15 years. And uh, if, you are, if you ask me the development area, I think, you know, in your country, there is a lot of, you know, opportunity for the agriculture. Sure, exactly. Agriculture. So like, you know, uh, last one, uh, nine months, uh, uh, ten months, I brought a lot of seed from my country and I distribute it to the people. I go to the village, I took it in my bag. Okay. Like yesterday also, in uh, uh, New York, I gave mm. four types of seed to a uh, man, I don't know. The people. The people. So I want that uh, they will cultivate it and I ask them, please, next year, if it is good growing next year, keep some seed for next. So I think in future, if I got opportunity, I will come again. And if I get uh, opportunity to work on the agriculture uh, background, I will love to come here again. <laughs> we hope to see you. <laughs> we wait to see you back. Uh, and people are here, you know, like uh, if I consider the village, in your village, uh, they don't have many things to be happy, like no electricity, no good uh, facilities, but yet people are smiling. People yeah. are smiling, people are happy.
Okay, any question from your side? Any interest? No question. Um, yes. I, I have another question. Um, yeah, you, supposedly you'll be here to see the university. Um, how do you see the university setting? And that is the premises compared to my country. Compared to your country. Okay, in my country, you know, I, I started on like uh, Dhaka College. This is the biggest college in our country, and uh, another one, Dhaka University. Both are in the capital. So it's crowding, lots of people. But here I found campus is very calm, open, relaxed. No lots of you know uh, vehicle horn. So I love this because it's it's the na natural campus. Uh, I love the thing like uh, the political, especially political issue. Mm. In my country, the politics, I'm sorry to say, it's not in good sometimes. They they try to establish their power and that makes them some non-friendly clash. Okay. <laughs> but as you said here, you yeah, have a politics as well, but you, yeah, you love university each other. Manage. Yeah, you manage it yes, nicely. Exactly. So as a student, my main role to study here, politics is the secondary one, I think. Yeah. So. Uh, you focus your study first, then politics, and also Later. like yeah, yeah exactly. that is good. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> really, maybe. Yeah. So, any any question from this side? Do you uh, talk to him? Do you have any um, passion to be to come again? Yes. Uh, actually, my office offered me to extend my time in here. But I have my own philosophy to stay one country in one year. And like I am working, I have a six uh, team member here. So according to my philosophy, after working one year, you don't have anything to give them. You don't have anything to take them. So it's better for them. They will get new faces. They will <laughs> get new knowledge from other uh, experts. And I will go other places. I will get a uh, new place, new people, new learning. But of course, I would love to come here, again, come here again if my office offer me for other area like we have project in Maguraka, we have project in Mind 91. So if I get opportunity, I will come again for other things. But of course, I will come, I will, I will come this Sierra Leone, even if, we, if it is not official after 10 or 15 years, I will come to Makini. I have done a lot of video, yeah. So I, I would love to see after 10 or 15 years, how is the situation now in Makini. I am sure it will be changed, a lot changed. <laughs> That is definite. Okay, thank you very much. I'm really happy to talk with you all. Our pleasure. Thank you very much. Yeah? So, your name is Francis. Francis. Yeah. Thomas. Thomas. Quantemol. 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 Quante. Quantemol. Quantemol. Ibrahim Quantemol. Ah, Ibrahim Quantemol. This is nice one. Gibrela. Gabriel, that means Gabriel type, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Gabriel, Gabriel, okay. So my name is Akbar, I think Bye. it's easy to remember. Yes, yes. So, so lastly, do you have any message for us to live with us or anything to live with us? Ah, no. Honestly stated, I don't have much thing to suggest you. I found you all people are human. You have a human mind. Yeah. Maybe your education will support you to know more about your specialty, like your accounting. But to be a human, that is not relevant what you are studying. So, just try to be loved to your people, love each other. We have differences like political, ideology, religion. Yeah, but we, we all are human. So, I am leaving my family back in Bangladesh and traveling country to country to support the humanity. So, I hope in future you can, you can think to support the humanity in my your God, country and uh, across the world. My God, yeah, people need some country, they need support, like the war country, Syria, Iraq, now Ukraine. People need support, humanity support. Either maybe if uh, you will not allow, you, you will not able to give me money or something to it, but you can at least smile me. Sure. And as I am a psychologist, so I, 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 I consider this smiling, smiling with good feelings. Sure. You know? Okay, thank you very much. Ah, <laughs>